Welcome to the Getting to Know AMX Insight series video. Combining AMX video with sophisticated Harman audio technologies, AMX Insight is the next generation of all-in-one digital video presentation switchers, providing a number of features across three very similar, yet different devices. So what's common to all three devices? Let's start with their names. Insight 813. Each device provides eight video inputs consisting of two VGA connections supporting analog video, while four HDMI and two DX Lite inputs support formats up to 4K with a 60 Hz refresh rate, 444 chroma subsampling, HDMI 2.0, and HDCP 2.2 copy protection. From the eight video inputs, one scaled video feed may then be simultaneously presented across three video outputs. The video outputs are comprised of one DX Lite and two HDMI connections supporting the same features previously mentioned among the digital video inputs. So there you go! Eight video inputs by one scaled video feed to three video outputs gives us the Insight 813. The scaled feed either allows for current HD signals to be upscaled or 4K60 signals to be downscaled providing flexible compatibility from source to display. In addition to this, advanced windowing features allow two sources to be sent to a single display in various preset configurations, and Insight will automatically scale both sources to fit the destination display at the best resolution possible. When switching sources, live production style video features such as transition effects may be used to provide a professional look and feel. Just a few moments ago, we were discussing the digital video inputs and outputs, and we learned that the HDMI and DX Lite connections support the same video formats. So why might we use one over the other? Well, if we need to transmit or receive up to 4K60 signals greater than a distance of 30 feet, then a passive HDMI cable will not cut it. Using CAT6 or better cable and DX Lite endpoints such as the DX Lite 4K60 444 HD Base T transmitter and DX Lite 4K60 444 receiver, we can use the DX Lite connections at the 813 to extend signals up to 328 feet. In addition to the video being extended, audio and power is also provided to DX Lite endpoints over CAT6 or better cabling. Finally, the 813 also provides direct feeds for IR signals to DX Lite endpoints. Moving on to audio, we find six embedded digital audio inputs, six analog stereo line inputs, and two mic inputs. One mic in either one embedded digital audio or analog stereo line input may be mixed together across two defined audio output groups. Either group may then be assigned to two independently configurable line level audio outputs and as an embedded audio path available on each of the three mirrored digital video outputs. An integrated fixed chain digital signal processor from BSS provides audio capabilities such as parametric equalizers and compression. Microphone processing also includes gating, ducking, and limiting to ensure a clean speech performance. If that's not enough, advanced feedback suppression from DBX processes the audio to remove any feedback loops for when the presenter places their microphone in front of a loudspeaker. All right, so we've covered audio and video, but what about control? The Insight 813 does not contain any internal controller, but it does support numerous interface options such as front panel controls, an integrated web graphical user interface, on-screen menu setup, and it's also a native Netlinks device that may be controlled using native Netlinks ICSP commands. When using a controller with the Insight 813, RS-232 control ports are accessible to push RS-232 commands out DX Lite paths to DX Lite endpoints. Now that we have a firm understanding of what the Insight 813 is, what's the difference with its siblings the 813A and the 813AC? The Insight 813A duplicates all the features previously discussed concerning the Insight 813 and integrates Crown's DriveCore amplification. Two sets of amplifier outputs are available. One is capable of delivering 50 watts of power to high impedance loudspeakers, making use of the 70 or 100 volt mono lines. The second set allows for stereo loudspeaker configurations and provides 25 watts per channel when connected to a 4 or 8 ohm load. 
Finally, ideal for control and automation of medium-sized rooms or multi-room applications, the Insight 813AC packs in everything the 813A has to offer and adds a fully programmable NX2200 Netlink Central Controller, specifically designed to control AV and building technology using multiple analog and digital formats. It also includes extensive network security features. So whether requiring a compact digital presentation system featuring audio and video processing, the additional need of amplification to keep attendees engaged, or a truly all-in-one solution supplementing an entire central controller, AMX Insight has a presentation switcher perfect for any high-use presentation area found in lecture halls, theaters, and other collaboration spaces found in corporate and government agencies. For more info, please visit www.amx.com and thanks for watching.